So, I remember back in high school and college, my favorite calculator to use was the TI-83+. Plus. It was so reliable, multifunctional, and had so many shortcuts. I think a lot of people can relate to this or the TI-84+. Plus. Unfortunately, after 5 or 6 years of use, I discovered it's not good for the FE exam. So the question is, which calculators are good for the FE exam, and which one's the best? I'll leave a link in the description below. However, I'm convinced that the best one is the TI-36X Pro. In just a second, I'm going to explain why. So the reason I love this calculator so much is that it's really cheap. If you're, if you're used to TI calculators, uh, the 80 series are usually like $100. This is only $15 and it's almost just as powerful as the graphing ones without the graphing. So pretty much every other function on there is just the same. Things such as matrices and vectors, complex numbers, definite integrals and derivatives, and the solve function are all on there. If you want the $15 version, Amazon for some reason has a bunch of like $22 and $20 versions out there, but I'm gonna leave a link below for the $15 version so that it's easier for you to find. Okay, so why is this calculator so useful for the FE exam? Well, in the FE exam, there are plenty of questions and you're really limited on time. So you want something that can cut down your time and give you shortcuts so that you can move through quickly for each problem. And this calculator definitely does the trick. There are so many functions on there that will make your, your job and day easier. So what are some of the functions on here that can help you? There are plenty of them, but I'm just gonna go over the few of them that can help you a lot. First of which will be full definite integrals and derivatives. What I love about this calculator is that it can solve that for you. So you can literally punch in an integral, for example, put in the starting and ending parameters, punch in the formula, press solve, and it'll just solve the integral for you. Next thing I want to mention are matrices and vectors. This is a huge lifesaver, as many of you may know. Um, so in the exam, there's lots of 3x3 three three and 2x2 two two, um, matrices and vectors that you have to solve, and this calculator has that for you. Some of them can be a little bit difficult to play with and figure out and solve, but I found a great tutorial for you to use, which I will leave a link in the description below. What's great about this calculator is that you can literally just punch in the matrix that you want and solve those annoying things that we don't really have a clue about, such as determinants, inverses, and adjoints. With just a couple of clicks, all that can be solved. Up next are sum series. This is a very powerful tool in the calculator. Again, just like the integrals and derivatives, the numbers can be punched in and through that, the sum will be solved for you. No need to figure out some crazy formula to figure that out. You just punch them in and you'll figure it out. Another great tool is the solve function. For example, you have an equation written on the paper, something really complex, such as like x to the fifth power plus 3x squared, da da da, bunch of variables. All you need to do with this calculator is punch in that formula, press solve, and bam, we get the x number in there. So if you want to look deeper into the reviews of this calculator, um, the pros, the cons, go ahead and click on the Amazon link below. There's plenty of reviews on there. Most people gave it four and a half stars because everyone likes it a lot, including myself. I think it's actually a really good find for just a regular college calculator as well because it's much different from the TI-83 in that it's a little more slick, a little bit more intuitive and easier to use, and just easier to carry around. Over time, I actually used the, the TI-36X Pro more often than my TI-83 because it was just so useful for me. One last thing I want to mention about this calculator is do not rely on it just to solve full problems on your FE exam because that might not work. However, you can use it to solve parts of it. And what used to take three to five minutes to solve, the calculator can just solve it within under a minute. It's very useful. Um, this calculator, like I mentioned, can be a little bit difficult or a little bit complex to use at first, but I found a really handy tutorial for you to use, and I'll leave that in the description below for you to see as well. Good luck on the test, study hard, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.